So you might be trying to go through and add certain voice effects on TikTok, whether it's your voice, whether it's audio that you have, it's actually a very basic process. What you wanna do is you wanna just make a TikTok as you normally would. So as you can see right here, I'll just go and make a TikTok. I'll just go and record my voice like this. Now there are a few different audios you can go and kind of edit. So you can record this type of audio. You can add you know, a video that you've already done. You already know how to do that. So when you're ready and you have the audio that you want, you can go and click the check mark. You can go ahead and kind of hear what your audio is before. Now, if you want to edit the audio, there's a few different ways you can do it. You can go through and edit the audio as you normally would. You can change it here if you want, but you can click on this drop down right here and there's an audio editing option. So what you can do is you can go and click there and you'll come into this panel. Now, this is what's really interesting. You can go ahead and at this panel right here, you can go and change your voice to all these other options. Now, there's a lot of them. Now, there are some new ones that are coming out. So one of the most popular ones now is Jesse. That is one of Jason's, I don't remember what it was. So that is the one that's pretty much coming out. Now it's going out in an ongoing basis. So I don't have that one, but essentially if you wanna change your voice, you can go and choose one of these other voices like this, and you can go and click that play button and you can get a glimpse of basically what your audio sounds like. Now you can also record audio right here if you want to, and you can also replace the original sound with the recording that you've just done here if you want to, or you can just listen to your audio here and you can go and do it that way. So if you wanna change it to a flute, you can. You might hear some of these and kind of basically hear the similarity between them, but that is basically how you do it. Now, if the audio that you chose is what you want, you can go and click save in the top right corner, and now your audio will be overwritten with basically that new audio that just came out. So here you can go and click next and post that, but that is basically how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.